Hi everybody, welcome to Sanchongli Power Factory. This is Jenny. And this is Artemis. We are from Guangzhou Sanchongli Appliance Company Limited. It's a company integrating manufacturing and trade of all kinds of home appliance accessories, as well as solar power inverter, gel battery charger, solar charger controller, refrigeration pass, and fan motor, LCD wall mount, power coach, PCB power board at. Our company is established in 1988, located in Foshan City, Guangdong Province, China. We are mainly in dealing with home appliances accessories. If you need something in this file, just feel free to contact us. Yes, and nowadays, coronavirus has been spread all over the world. So please take care of yourself. It is better to stay at home. If you have to go outside, please wear a mask and wash your hands frequently before you touch your nose and mouth. Right, and thank you so much for watching our videos in this hard time. Today we will show you our new solar charger in our office and grow to make a presentation to you. As well know, there are two main types of solar controller, PWM mode and MPPT mode. The transfer rate of MPPT is higher than PWM. So today we are going to introduce a series of MPPT controller, ST to MP. Let's have a look at this product video first. For your watching. Next, we would like to introduce more details for you. All right, there are 30 ampere, 40 ampere, 60 ampere available for this type of controller. The transfer rate of them are up to 95%. This type MPPT controller can automatically recognize the voltage according to the system. The system type is 12 voltage, 24 voltage, 48 voltage, which can be automatically recognized and identified or set manually. And let's take a look at the function of ST to MP. Button menu, button down, button up, button enters, and LCD screen display. An LCD screen can display power generation, battery voltage, capacity, charging current, DC output, and fault conditions. And it's built in solar data monitoring interface and cooling fan. The hanging style design makes it convenient to install. There are three types of charging mode. The first one is constant current. This type is the function that protecting electrical appliance and stabilizing current. The second mode is constant voltage. When the voltage is rise to a certain stage, it will come slow down and the last mode is floating charge. That means charging with a small current when the battery is almost fully charged. The maximum PV input voltage of solar panel is 150 voltage. You need to pay attention to the cable specification. Wire diameter need to be less than 10 square millimeter copper wire, strongly recommended. And it is suitable to lead acid battery, corrodial battery, different ion batteries. You can also adjust the charging current and voltage by yourself. Yes, and almost of MPPT controllers are with over current protection. Soft circuit protection, overload protection, over discharger protection, and high temperature protection. The last thing you need to pay attention to is the solar panel. 
Let me show you the specification of solar panel if you want to buy this controller. If you have 12 volt battery installed to a 30 ampere controller, you need to input mass 18 volt 450 watt solar panel. If you have 48 volt battery installed to a 60 ampere controller, you need to input mass 72 volt 3400 watt solar panel. Now let's show the connection method here. Firstly, connect the battery to the controller charging interface. Secondly, connect the solar panel to the solar controller interface. And lastly, connect the DC load to the corresponding interface. Please note that the positive and negative electrode can be reversed. What well, if I reverse the positive and negative electrode? Will it cause a short circuit in the controller? No, because there is a short circuit protection. Just that if you reverse the positive and negative electrode, the controller will not work. Is this ST to MP controller waterproof? Can it be installed outdoor? Not exactly. Almost the solar controllers are not waterproof, so we don't suggest installing outdoor. What kind of battery can be used? Lead acid battery, collodial battery, lithium battery. What is the maximum temperature limit protection? It is over 70 degrees Celsius, so it will not be damaged easily. What is recommended voltage solar controller for the light bulb only? The light bulb voltage is based on the battery installed to the controller. What are the voltage range and current range? For voltage range, there are 12 voltage, 24 voltage, 48 voltage available. And for the current range, there are 30 ampere, 40 ampere, and 60 ampere. What is the warranty and coverage? It is one year for warranty. You could send back to us if there is any quality problem during this period. How many units in one box? For 30 ampere, it is 8 pieces in one carton. And for 40 and 60 ampere, there are 4 pieces in one carton. The last question, what is the lead time of delivery? Almost about 7 to 15 days, but we will deliver goods as soon as the deposit is received. Let me show you the application of solar controller in a home solar power system. At least you need to buy solar panel, solar controller, solar inverter, and battery. This is the base configuration of a solar system. So this is the solar controller we introduced to all of you just now. And this is the DC bulb load according to the battery voltage. This is the power inverter which can convert 12 voltage DC to 20, 220 voltage AC for the AC bulb. We have all the solar products, so if you have any interest, please contact us freely. Thanks for its pronation, so today we are going to stop here. If you have any question about this product, just leave a comment below or send us a message. Yes, and during this special period, please take good care of yourselves and your families. We'll talk to you guys again next time. Bye for now. Bye-bye.